Hi beauties, how's everybody doing? Thanks for joining me, welcome back. Today I am doing a collab. It is called the Fall Back Collab. Rosa Beauty had came up with a collab and everything and invited a whole bunch of us. And my part in the whole fall collab is I'm going to talk about some hair care and skin care for the upcoming colder months to keep your hair hydrated and your face hydrated. So if you'd like to see my products that I'm going to share with you guys, keep on watching. All right, so yeah, we're into fall already. It's a really big challenge for my skin, but a lot of times also for my hair. Like summertime, I have some challenges with my hair, not so much my skin, but when fall and winter come, oh my goodness, I have to constantly be doing things to help keep my hair in order and everything. So anyway, before I get started into everything, I want to remind you guys, Rosa's Beauty Fashion had come to a bunch of us and asked us if we wanted to do the Fall Back Collab. And I have been in several of her different collabs and enjoyed it very much. And she has invited a good bit of people. Um, so basically there will be a link down below in the description bar. And it will just, it's gonna be like one link that will just go through each of the videos so you don't have to do anything else just click the link and let it go ahead and play down along the line of all the videos and see what everybody's doing some might be doing looks some might be sharing other tips or uh, diys um, cooking or baking kind of items or something like that you can go ahead and see what else everybody is creating and everything and if you like, you can go ahead and subscribe to them, uh, show them some love, maybe give them a thumbs up and everything. So hair, my hair in the winter time does play a lot of, um, cause you get the static and you know, just all that great, great stuff. <laughs> Especially when it comes to um, natural curly hair, it sometimes can be a blessing and a pain and all in one. So I would say, you know, like for your hair, if you're somebody that has hair like mine or just, just anybody really in general, some of the good things is to find some shampoos or conditioners that has some hydration in there, like some maybe oils in it, in the shampoo, um, or you could put your own oils in your shampoo. So for instance, one of my favorite shampoos that I'm really liking, I liked it for the summertime too, and I think it's going to be extremely great for the upcoming fall and winter. My L'Oreal Extraordinary, Extraordinary uh, Oil Nourishing Shampoo and Conditioner. And these have several different kind of oils in them. If you can find um, anything that uh, kind of says the word hydration in the shampoo and conditioner um, that fits your hair type and everything I think it would be really good so L'Oreal this is one of them I know OGX I have one I think it's the coconut water one that one would be a really good one Tresemme has some good ones I do like Tresemme they have some pretty good um, in the in the drugstore shampoos and conditioners okay so speaking of this was sent to me because OGX has sent me a lot of different things. This is the Hydrate and Repair Argan Oil of Moroccan Oil, and it's a miracle in a shower oil. Okay, this product here is really good. I used it a couple times already, and very little goes a long way. This you can actually take a couple drops and put it in your shampoo or conditioner to help give your hair a little some more. Um, hydrating or you know nourishing your hair keeping it soft and smooth you can also use this for the body it's it's for all over i used it for my body so this guy's a little bit of a multitasker that you can get i would probably recommend this if you would like to even add like let's say you have your favorite shampoo in that you could add a couple drops to your favorite shampoo or conditioner whichever way you want to do it you know and also use it on your body of course be careful 
you want to make sure your tub and everything is cleaned out afterwards. I didn't notice a huge problem, but still, just better be safe than sorry. Another hair oil that I really like and I think will play a really good role for me. Um, so, and I do really like a lot of the OGX. Um, a lot of these were sent to me. I mean, of course, I'm not going to lie about that. They were sent to me, but um, I, they have worked for me and they're pretty reasonably priced as well. This is the Healing and Vitamin E uh, Penetrating Oil. This is another oil that you could use um, after you wash your hair and everything. You get out of the shower and your hair, either when your hair is damp or when it's dry, whichever. Um, this one from OGX here, the Weightless Hydration Plus Coconut Water. It's a weightless hydration oil. Now this one's nice because it is a spray. And shake it up. That's what I usually do. I like to spritz around on my hair and just you which you can really smell the coke if you don't like coconut you might not like that part work along in there and it actually helps the frizzies for my hair yeah i really like that because it does help for the hair um it does make it feel a little more smoother and just yeah it's it's really nice this one's the proganics which is the pro line from ogx again it was sent to me um I do have other products here, so, but I just wanted to share some of these because these I do feel like are going to play a good role, like I said. Um, this is Proganics Quench Moisture Balm Nourish, and it's a nice nourishing balm. Again, it's in a nice pump. I believe this one does, it has coconut H2O in it and electrolytes. This is going to help you with uh, maintaining your frizzies, the, um, you know, keeping your hair more smooth and hydrated and feeling soft and supple and all that kind of stuff. So this one here, I think I've added this in damp hair. Again, you can put it in dry. So either damp or dry hair, you can do that with this. This here is from Joya Co. I feel any good deep conditioner is good to do. Um, maybe, um, some could do it like once a, once a week, maybe twice a week. I would do it probably twice a week now with, you know, winter coming up and everything. Um, I do like the L'Oreal that goes with the Extraordinaire Oil Complex uh, set. I do like that one. There's one in Sally's Beauty Supply. It's called an Argan Oil one. That one's really great, pretty reasonably priced. Um, this one was sent to me. It's a uh, Joyaco K Pack color. It's a color therapy luster lock. So if you have color treated hair, which I do, which I need to color here soon, um, but if you have color treated hair, that already does damage, and you know you're going to have to do a little extra more steps in keeping it hydrated, nourished and maintained. It is a really good deep conditioner and I think any deep conditioner would be great. So I would totally say look into a good deep conditioning mask. This can be used for both. This is from the company Livin Rose. It's the jojoba oil. I showed this a lot on my channel which I'm getting there, getting down there, but it's been a long good use for me. I I use this on my face. I use this in my hair. You can just do a little bit of everything. Um, I like what uh, Sharon uh, Capehart had to say. Um, she had put and patted along under her eye area to kind of keep it a little bit, little bit more hydrated. And I put uh, a link to Sharon down below too. She's pretty good uh, with skincare. Now. If I would use this on my face, it's a little more dense, so I would use it more at night. Speaking of oils, I have my Josie Marin Argan Oil. I I love this stuff. I got it in a set in a TSV not long ago, so I did purchase this. Um, but you can use this in your hair and as well on your face. This is an oil I feel like you can use in the daytime as well as nighttime. It's not as dense as the jojoba oil is. It's not as um, that feeling. This one's a little bit more lighter and I feel like you can pat along. I really like this and this is another multitasker oil. Since I'm on uh, Josie Marin and her argan oil, I have been recently using her argan milk and this is an intensive hydrating treatment. This is really, really nice. This, if you put these two together, and I do them 
when I do do these two, for the most part, I do them at night. I will do them at night. There has been a couple times I've done them during the daytime because I feel like I needed a little bit of extra something. But this is a really, really great treatment, hydrating treatment. I really, really am liking this. Something else for the face that I really like that um, kind of you can do throughout, you can kind of do throughout the day. I love my Mario Abdescu facial spray with aloe herbs and rose water. This spray here, I love this stuff. And this is like this size here that I have, which is a four ounce, I believe it's like seven bucks, which is not bad at all. Mm. I just, I love it. It's very, it is, it's very, I love the smell of rose. If you don't like the smell of rose, then yeah, you probably won't like it. I like it. It feels very <sighs> cooling, relaxing, and, and very hydrating. So yeah, I'm probably gonna have to stock up on a couple of these because I have a funny feeling I might need them. I have this reviving. It's from Lano Cream. It's a night cream. This one's a night cream. You can get day cream, night cream, and all that kind of stuff. And it's with the New Zealand Manuka Honey. Manuka Honey is all the wrap right now. Skincare industry. It really does help um, plump your skin, hydrate your skin. Any moisturizer. It doesn't have to be the Lana Cream, but I do find Lana Cream in TJ Maxx, which I got this for like $5.99. And it's really great moisturizer. There's the day cream, there's night cream, um, there's even um, masks um, for under the eye or anything like that. And it's, it's a very nice moisturizer. Anything like that, if you can find with the Manuka honey in it, will be a big plus for you. Help keep your, you know, your skin plump and hydrated. Do show this a lot. It's the St. Ives Timeless Skin Collagen Elastin Moisturizer. This is another moisturizer you can use on your face, but you can also use it on your body, anywhere, all over. And um, it is really nice. I find for six bucks, which that's how much this container is, it is well worth mentioning. Um, it is one that just soaks up and your skin just drinks it all up like it's you know, it's so happy that you're putting it on your skin and everything. I use this, if I use it on my face, I use it a lot during the daytime to just give a little bit of extra something for my, you know, on my skin and everything. So I do use it a lot in the daytime, but nighttime would be fine too. It's not the, you know, I just find it's a nice light moisturizer that I could put uh, on my skin during the daytime. Now this mask is a mask that targets for hydration and it's from Queen Helene which I really like a lot of her face masks and again for the price you can't beat it I get a lot of mine in the Sally Beauty Supply I do know she sells I believe in Walmart I've seen in Target there is an online store you can buy some of her stuff at um, just you know you could type in the Queen Helene name and you know a lot of the stuff will pop up but this is called the hydrating olive oil mask and this has been a really good mask on those days, which as you can see, I am pretty much done. I mean, need me in one of these, especially coming up. Um, but it's a really nice mask. It really does hydrate. It does feel really nice. Queen Helene, this one here, the olive oil mask is really good. This is another Queen Helene item and it's the Marilla Face and Body Cream. This is a nice big container. This is... Where is it at? This is 15 ounces, okay? Um, it is a very thick, dense cream. And uh, you can see I use a good bit of it. It is a very thick, dense cream. I do love the smell of it. To me, it smells, to me, there's something like, almost smells yummy. See how, I mean, it's really thick. But like as I'm doing that, it's like melting in between my fingers and everything. And this moisturizer here, I do put on face and body. I do as it says on that part. And putting it on my face, what I do for my face, I will do it definitely at night. I would never wear that in the daytime. Not myself anyway. It feels like 
smooth like a baby's butt if I do that sometimes when I really need that little extra something when you wake up your your skin's gonna love you for it I even done this on my feet my feet love this this is really good foot cream if you suffer from dry cracked heels sometimes or anything this is really good foot cream as well for the body since we're speaking of the body I love tree hut the tree hut uh, body sugar scrubs I love these. I have quite a few. I haven't even used this one yet. It's the Hawaiian uh, Kukai. Kukai. I don't know if that's how you pronounce it or not. It smells amazing, whichever way. This is what a lot of them look like. Oh my goodness, I love these. Because, yeah, you really want to keep up with exfoliating your body as well as your face and everything. And then lastly, your lips. Now, I do like um, Sarah Happ. She has um, really amazing scrubs that you can use on your lips. I've never tried the e.l.f. one. A lot of people love the simple little e.l.f. in a tube. It looks like a lipstick, and you use that to exfoliate. I might get that one and try it out, but you can make your own, as a matter of fact. You can just take like a little bit of brown sugar and put just even regular like olive oil not a whole lot like um, if you did like a half a tablespoon of brown sugar a fourth of a teaspoon of um, an oil of, of whatever like you can do if you want to get almond oil you can put almond oil in it if you want to do um, any of those kind you know you can put whatever kind of oil uh, oil in you want to but you can just use reg you can use just regular olive oil and just mix it up um, it probably will last you for about a week maybe I think or so many days and the brown sugar and the oil and just exfoliate your lips there you go got rid of all the you know dead skin and everything off your lips and then I love using my lip balms this one's a really good one from Nivea it's the lip butter this one's vanilla and macadamia kiss I use this every night or just whenever I need it, which I'm getting a dent in that one already. Jeez, I might need to get another. I'm making a dent in that. Oh, that smells so good. Oh, I love that one. If you don't want to put your fingers in it, because I know some people don't like doing the dipping finger thing. If you don't like that, you can get their lip balms. I do believe they have lip balms. Any kind of lip balm. It doesn't have to be the Nivea one. But that's what I wanted to share with you guys of what I'll be using and what kind of give you some ideas of different products maybe you can want to try maybe you never tried anyway thank you so much for joining me I really appreciate that please do not forget to go down below and check out the link Rosa did for all of us in this fall collab or fall back collab please go and check the link out and show some love and also if you did come from somebody else's channel to join me welcome hope you stick around and stay around and i would love to have you, you can go ahead and click the subscribe button down below and i do do videos every week also if you would give me a thumbs up that make me so happy and i love it so much and as always beauties please remember to just be yourself love yourself and let the real beauty shine through so until the next time you take care i will see you then love you guys Bye. But that's what I wanted to share with you guys of what I'll be using and what kind of give you some ideas of different products. Maybe you can want to try, maybe you never tried. Um, not necessarily have to use the exact products I shared. You can go ahead and get your own products um, and, you know, like look around and find things that might work for you um, to help keep your body and face and hair, everything all in order for the upcoming cold months ahead. So anyway, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate that. Please do not forget to go down below and check out the link to Rosa, to, to the link that Rosa did for all of us in this fall collab, or fall back collab. Please go and check the link out and show some love and check everybody out. Please go check the link out and show everybody some love. Maybe give them a thumbs up and subscribe if you like. And like I said, it will just play continuously once you press on the link. And also, if you did come from somebody else's channel to join me, welcome. Hope you stick around and stay around. And I would love to have you. you go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. And I do do videos every week. Also, if you would, give me a thumbs up. That would make me so happy and I love it so much. 
And as always, beauties, please remember to just be yourself, love yourself, and let the real beauty shine through. So until the next time, you take care. I will see you then. Love you guys. Bye.